down the street with Evie, people often, when they first met her, the first thing they said was, oh, what's wrong with your child? Because mm. she looked a little bit different. And until I had this language, I'd just sort of list off all of the things about her condition, you know, which were really tricky, you know, things like, well, she can't walk and she can't talk and she doesn't do this and she can't do that. And, you know, in that space, um, I hadn't shared anything about my child. Mm. But when I could describe her as a human being, you know, with all the things that she had to do and, and what I was proud of in her, they then saw a human being rather than, you know, a collection of failing body parts. And then in that moment, they could look at her again and they'd often say, oh, isn't she beautiful? Look at those deep eyes and those delicate fingers. And in that moment, that fear just evaporated because we connected as humans, even though there was difference. Mm. So, yeah. So, a, a question back to you. Like, you know, a lot of this sympathy type language, you know, people will put this language out there to make you, you know, they don't know how to react themselves. They go, oh, you poor thing. So, they're, they're trying to be sympathetic to you. Did, you. did you find that it was people being sympathetic to you? Or did you find it was people that just had no idea how to respond to, to what was confronting them? Yeah, I think when people don't know what to say, they often reach towards cliches. So mm -hmm. I got a lot of people saying, oh, you know, special kids are only given to special parents. And that does come from a kind place, but it doesn't land when when you're feeling exhausted or isolated or alone or frustrated or in deep grief or trauma. Um, so I think people assume that they can say the right right things but until you've actually asked a person what they need or um, what matters to them i think um our language can often fall really short of kindness when it doesn't meet what that person is wanting to talk about 